This is the easiest way to create hyper smooth slow motion footage right in DaVinci Resolve. I'm gonna use this two way base jump I shot with my buddy Ryan and I. We're gonna select our clip and we're gonna hit Command R. This is gonna bring up the read time controls. You can also right click on here and then bring them up as well. And that's how we're actually gonna bring up the read time curve. We need both of these open. So once these are open, we're going to select our entry and exit points for when we want the slow motion to start. So I'm gonna start right when I exit the ramp and then I'm gonna stop it right when I pitch to deploy my parachute. So right about there is probably good. We're gonna hit this keyframe icon right here. Then we're gonna go forward. Right about there when I pitch my parachute, I'm gonna select another keyframe. Now if we select our keyframes and we click this little icon here, this is gonna ease in, ease out. This makes the transition from normal speed to slow motion very smooth. I'm just gonna select the other one. And then we're gonna go up and we're gonna change this speed in the center to 10%. Now this sounds crazy. This initial video was shot in 60 frames per second in 4K. Now my timeline here is 24 frames per second. So usually you only wanna go in factors of 20, 80, 40, 20, 10%. In this case, I'm gonna show you guys how we can go below the normal frame rate. 10% of 60 frames per second, that's only six frames. Now watch. We're gonna change this speed to 10%, and then the magic actually lies over here. We're gonna go into retime and scaling. We're gonna change to optical flow, and then our motion estimation, we're gonna change to speed warp faster. You can do better too. Even the faster here, my computer almost does it in real time. We're gonna go ahead and play it back. super smooth. It just looks so clean. It's, you can barely even tell that, that this is AI. Basically, it's turning it from 60 frames per second to 240 frames per second, which is unreal. We can even add a little bit of music here to spice it up a little bit, too. Yeah, buddy. Bye. That's all I got for you guys. See you in the next one.